right, today we are going to be working on this Turbo Chef oven right here. We have to replace this heater here, which is at the very top. <coughs> so let's get it open and show you what it looks like. Okay, got the covers off. So now the heater sits underneath all of this. So we're gonna have to take, take all of this out to get to the heater plate and get it changed and there's a solid state relay right back there that also has to be replaced so if you hadn't seen one this is your turbo chef oven you have your magnetrons left right diode circuit board high voltage transformer filament transformers this oven produces 4,000 volts so i got the power isolated in the back with a lockout tag on it make sure nobody turns on the power and we're going to get this thing taken apart okay we got it all disconnected this is the plate this is the heater right there uh, notice the heater wire one side is broke so we're gonna have to fix that this side has been overheating uh, also make a repair on that uh, got the heater loose so it should just lift right out and it's right there <clears throat> got a new gasket for it uh, we'll make some repairs put in a new heater and they'll be back up in business All right, we got the new heater installed. Had to repair the power leads for the heater. This little top heater ohms out at 13 ohms, according to TurboChef. So we got it all back installed, bolted down. So all we gotta do now is just uh, put that piece back down, get everything reassembled, put this uh, insulating piece back over it and go from there okay see got the insulation back down taped it back down with some foil tape Gotta lower the top plate and like so there's a sensor wire down here have to pull back up it's just right here it needs to come back up through there before we set it down
And it, that goes back down like that. So now we'll get all the screws back in and start putting all the components back together. Alright, got her all put back together, wired up. Magnetrons are back in place. Uh, got the solid state relay that's replaced. All right, we're ready to put some power on it and take it for a test drive. Okay, we're gonna run it in test mode now. First, we'll test the magnetrons. And the magnetrons are pulling correct amps, 17.3. Alright, got the blower. Blower's working. Alright, next we'll test the top heater. And the 86 degrees. Make sure the top heater starts heating up. And we can also take an amp draw on it. Get to the wires at 89 degrees, 91, so top heater's working. Test the bottom heater. And the bottom heater is the IR. Top heater's working. Bottom heater's temperature is rising, so it's working. Turn that off. So everything is working correctly. So now we'll go ahead and warm this, get it warmed up, get the panels on, have them cook something, verify the operation, and this one is done. Okay. Okay, Turbo Chef oven repair completed. As you see, menu's back up, it's warmed up. They got their oven to go with that one. All right, people, that's it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Hit that like button, helps with the algorithm.